I love wonderful people from all over the world. Now we are with all animals, with all alpacas, llamas. consider your schedule to live these magical experiences with us. Inca lands. Uh, we are family that live upon the mountains you know, uh, over the sacred valley of the Incas. Just previous to Machu Picchu. Yeah, so the idea is to share with you, you know, uh, with the people that is interested to learning more about the Incan uh, style of life. Yeah. about it to include it in, in your itineraries. The epic journeys in my mother tongue is Quechua. When I had it, uh, 15 years I learned Spanish and later uh, English uh, as other languages as well. So this is now the life of experience after and upon the mountains. Okay right now it's uh, snowing up here not to give you a better idea how high that we live you know? uh, up on the mountains the Andes usually it gets snow you know, in some certain times of the year you know? uh, right now we are getting snow that's why you see those mountains covered by the white snow wonderful experiences and as I say, no, Machu Picchu is a beautiful site no, that was created and constructed by my ancestors, no, the Incas. And these people, this family that we live here, they are not descendants of, the, of them, no, this Inca rice. No. We have these animals, the llamas, the packs, yeah. up on the mountains. Okay, so. Uh, I will say now we will offer you this kind of experiences beautiful here uh, previous to Machu Picchu, beyond the Machu Picchu. It's incredible, yes, incredible. Yeah, let me show you some of them. So, feel free to contact us now to live this experience in a beautiful way, in the authentic lifestyle. Yeah, it's incredible, wonderful time. This is exactly how the, my ancestors, the Incas in the old times, they used to uh, have no, the state of life. The llama, it was used in the daily life. And now we continue using these animals no, to use in our daily life these llamas are helpful for us when we travel up on the mountains the llamas are able to walk in the uneven terrains yeah you can walk you can climb rocky areas easy peasy We 
we have more more of them no? more, some of the llamas are further up upon the mountains from Peru yeah we are neighbors of Machu Picchu wonderful the Andes yeah, it's incredible it's impressive how the llamas are not living on the Andes on the high Andes yeah it's incredible from this beautiful llamas some of my llamas are walking running around right now yeah? it's a beautiful color of llama we use it the bull these llamas no? to make a for carving the clothing that we use it up here is out of llama wool and baka wool okay it's a beautiful epic journey running up here yeah so, once you visit Peru no, it's going to be part of your journey to Machu Picchu travel Llamas. So this is the last beautiful itinerary and beautiful um, schedule that they create, not that we create, you know, uh, the Incan people, yeah, Incan two guys, to, to create a beautiful Journey, epic journey, unforgettable, memorable, and lasting experiences. Yeah, with with the llamas hiking the Andean trails. These beautiful trails in Peru that we have to offer uh, for trekking and hiking. It's incredible, yeah. This journey that we offer, it uh, takes uh, two days, couple days hiking with the llamas from the Andes. Third day cultural activities, you know, and on day fourth, basically you're going to able, you'll be able to visit Machu Picchu. Yeah, so let's say to complement the the journey the experiences you'll be able to visit Machu Picchu yeah, from the hands of the Incan mountaineering tour guides that will be yes I'm very proud yeah so check it out find us on the social medias and uh, see your comments on TripAdvisor uh, get in touch with us yeah I will be continue uh, with the upgrades uh, on my YouTube site new videos with other videos about the llamas yeah these are the llamas incredible yeah beautiful these llamas they live in the high Andes yeah is this the place where they let's say uh, prefer living yeah great and the last day has been snowing very heavy up, up here but we got the, uh, the the heater yeah right now we got nice heater to warm up and right now we are taking some hot drinks hot dream when it's snowing when it gets cold up here it's really good yeah my father next to me and he's going to talk a little bit we'll talk in Quechua language the language of the Incas Papa, is it going to be a good language? yes, it's going to be a good language 
en cuarto de primaria. Cuarto de primaria, ya. Yeah. Uh, I have a, I did a question to my father, no? I, the question is if he uh, went to the school. And he said, yes, he did yes primary until fourth grade. Uh, up here in these small communities in Peru, uh, we don't have, uh, no, at that time, it was just no until this grade. But happily, in the last years, we we have primary schools, but we don't have uh, secondary school. Yeah, to to be able to continue study in the high school or secondary school, we have to travel uh, to an, to another town. Let's say. You know, far from here, <clears throat> like uh, 25 kilometers further down. Okay, and um, is this no the the old house? You now where we live, my parents live, where I live. You no, know, it's, it's it's quite uh, simple. You no, know, as my ancestors, you no, know, my ancestors, the Incas, they were uh, simple. Yeah, the characteristic of the architecture of the Incas is the simplicity. It's simple the architecture. Yeah, it's just basically stones and touch roof. That's it. Yeah, it's not so complicated. You no, know, the life, the type, the style of life that we have in this in the Andes. Mm -hmm. <coughs> We are <coughs> preparing a meal, really good meal, yeah, out of cereals and potatoes, uh, <coughs> out of uh, alpaca meat. Now we get meat here from alpaca, yeah, and we got some guinea pigs as well. But guinea pigs we don't eat um, so often. We eat more often the alpaca meat. Okay, so we are neighbors of Machu Picchu. <coughs> Machu Picchu is just uh, very close from here, yeah, from where we live. Okay, and there are these people, descendings from the Incas we, where we live, yeah. So always I will invite to you, in case you want to live this experience with us, no, you can come over to visit us, and learn, these uh, unique experiences, epic experiences with us. Okay, see you in the next, in the next episodes. Thanks for your time and for watching the videos. I already upload some videos in the YouTube channel. If I take a look, you know, I check it out some of those videos too. You now all my contents, the videos that I create, is uh, about. Uh, my culture, yeah. I will tell also tell to you to subscribe and spread it out this kind of contents, videos about the style of life of the descendants of the Inca people, the families. <laughs>